What is this planet? I don't know. We've never been here before. Maybe we're on the edge of the universe. Hey, cool. Let's see if we can find some aliens. Hey, the ground is moving. The planet's gonna eat us. We have to get back to the ship right now. Then let's get the heck out of here. Oh no, the control panel's not working. We're stuck in the middle of nowhere. Hold on, let me just give you a hand. It's just me, Captain Spirit, who can bend all matter to his will. I did it. I still got the power. Now I just need to make a cool costume for Captain Spirit. I gotta have a cool cape to fly. Good thing I have one. Mask or no mask? Secret identity or not? Hmm. Yep, looks cool so far. Let's see. What about the armor? Oh, cool. Should he be dark or colorful? Beware, Mantroid. Watch out. Captain Spirit is ready for battle. Hello, Saturday morning. I can do anything I want today. I hope I can draw as good as mom someday. Hmm. I could do a training session with my power. It is time for my secret tattoo. Only my team will know what it means. Man, I wanted to go to that, but Dad had to watch the playoffs. Every superhero team needs a supervillain team. So glad I did my English homework already. Miss Stroud's pretty nice, and she likes my stories. The secret treasure is buried out there in the wild. Now, I have to locate the second part of the map. Sorry, you're too cute to fight evil. I 
It would be cool to shoot like that. Ball. I should ask Dad to show me again. At least the forest warrior protect me from the snow ghost. This isn't greedy, right, Santa? Plus, Dad will love that I want basketball lessons. Dad took away my firecrackers when I blew up the garbage can last year. Hmm. I wonder where he hit them. What kind of a Viking would I be? Dad said he was going to fix that last month. <sighs> right? Chris. Only my brain waves can activate the monitor. Ooh, the shark stinger is looking for victims. Look out! Here comes the evil car! Ah! That pedestrian better get out of the way. How can you run over innocent people? Nobody should die like that. Mantroid and his minions will pay for this. You can't win this battle, Noctarius. It's already over, Power Bear. Don't let Mantroid control you. Nobody controls me. Mantroid is my leader, and he wants you to die. <laughs> Give up now. We don't have to fight. You're not the boss of me, Power Bear. You have amazing powers. Why don't you join our team? Join Captain Spirit? Are you serious? He's my enemy! Only because Mantroid brainwashed you. You can help the world with us. Liar! Where were you and Captain Spirit when Mantroid saved my life? Huh? Good guy? I'm sorry, Nocturus. We want to be there for everybody. You're the enemy. Now take this! <laughs> ah. Ooh! Oh, my back! How? How did you do this? I can't move! Captain Spirit! Captain Spirit! Please come to my aid! I can't defeat Nocturus on my own! I can't! Captain Spirit! Release him, Power Bear. Oh, yeah. Captain Spirit's got your back, loser. He decided to spare you. That's a real hero. Now go back to your master. Me and Troy will get his revenge for me. <sighs> Thank you for keeping me from the dark side, Captain. Captain Spirit doesn't eat weapons, but just in case. Chris, I mean now. I know, I'm coming. When? Hmm, this is a perfect day to watch Frozen. 
Last time, Dad told me not to sing along so loud. Gotta have a super cape. Only Captain Spirit can wear it. Mmm, chocolate. Thanks, Claire. Jeez, good job, chocolate hog. That was a fun birthday party at Pizza Arcade. I hope it'll be cool next year. Chris, I mean now. I heard you, jeez. Do not make me come over there. This sucks. Hey, Chris, you better come to breakfast when I holler at you, or else we're gonna have a problem. But I... Don't. This isn't a hotel, buddy. I got things to do. What'd you expect, a waffle? I just like sunny side up. Like mom used to make. <laughs> yeah. Me too. But that's not gonna happen. I know. You can't keep saying mom used to do this or that. I know more than anybody, Chris. I know, okay? Yeah, okay. So, Dad, what's the big plan for today? Uh, big game plan. Even though we'll probably lose again. Gotta get rid of that coach. Today, I bet we win. Now, that's the fucking spirit. I'm sorry. Don't swear, okay? I don't. Superheroes don't swear. <laughs> Looks like I'm off the team. Nah. You're cool. Like a rebel. Hey, is your, uh, your arm okay? Looks better. Anybody, yeah. Uh, Ask you about it or uh, say anything at all? Well, it kind of hurts a little. Really? I, I can give you an ice pack and maybe one of my pills. No pain and no swelling. It makes me sad that I. That, that you got hurt. It's not that bad. I'm fine. Okay, okay. Won't bother you anymore. So, so you must be excited for Christmas. I'm always excited for Christmas. Hint, hint. I was hoping Santa might maybe get me a new console since mine is broken. Then Santa needs to get me a new job. It has to be a console. A basketball costs 10 bucks. Okay. 
Oh, since it's Saturday, are we going to get a Christmas tree? You said we could get a real pine. Yes, I did, and yes, we are. But I just want to watch the game before we go, okay? But you always fall asleep. <laughs> I won't today. And if I do, just wake me up and we'll go. Promise. Okay. You promise? I do. Now go take advantage of your weekend. Perfect weather outside for you to play. Whatever. You're free. Come grab me later. Okay, what would Captain Spirit do? Crap! Jesus, what was that? What the hell are you doing in there? Cannot be. Mm. Seriously? <sighs> Boring. I can help Dad do the laundry using my mind magic. Now you will learn your lesson and stay clean. I hope I set this right. I've never seen a beaver around here. Ooh, Dad's going shopping. Let's see, what do we need? Chris, these are the most important numbers for you on this list. Oh yeah, <laughs> cool story, Dad.
<laughs> Zap! The awful green things are flushed into space. Ugh, I hate that beer can smell. I'm sure I can beat my high score on Mustard Party, too. Ah, I need a pin code. What is it? Grandma and Grandpa are so cool, but no way I'm ever leaving Dad. Hmm, Dad is too busy to care if I go online. There is my hot dog man. I can't see dad selling homes. Whoa, is he getting us tickets again? Best dad ever. That would be a blast being a freight hopper. Choo choo. Oh, those are Dad's pages. Oh yeah, that's how you dominate. That's it. And that is how you shoot the ball. I'm frozen. All night. I must build a fire. Goodbye, Log. God damn, you're on fire. Never been. <sighs> that loves his that notebooks. I think Dad reads these. I think he just takes them from work. Why does he drink that if it just makes him mad? Maybe Dad would want to watch an anime instead. No. Dinosaur Land is open for business. Eat everybody! I am Mar T-Rex, and you are my lunch. Roar!
This dinosaur won't need a grumpy old dad, right? Right? Dad. Yes, yes, yes! Come on! Dad. Chris, I know what you're doing. Stop. No, no, hmm. no! Maybe I should help Dad clean the house. Instead of playing... Geez, where's the heat? I bet the water eater's sleeping again. Welcome to W-H-E-R-O. Today we are honored to have an interview with the world's most awesome superhero, Captain Spirit. Hello, Beaver Creek. Captain Spirit, when do you think you will defeat Mantroid? Mantroid is a bully and a coward. He can't hide, but he can run. We heard reports that he is putting together a team of supervillains. Do you have any message for them? My message is that Mantroid will never win, and I will find you, and I will crush you. Yes, that is what this town wants to hear. That's my job, and that's why we love you. Can you tell us who your superheroes are? The only hero I have is me. That's good to know. Can you give us a hint about how you discovered your epic powers? No. Okay, do you have any final words for your audience? Be nice and always fight for the good team. Thank you, Captain Spirit, for being our hero. And now back to W-H-E-R-O News. I feel naked without my costume. I never get tired of hot dog man. Never. Man, I love this issue. Wish I could draw like this. I can't believe Dad let me put these stickers here. Maybe he likes them too. No diving today, Nemo. Ooh, now I can use that makeup from Halloween. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, look at the scoreboard, motherfuckers. All right. No one will guess my secret identity now. Okay, that's a good start. But now it's time to build the rest of my costume. I'm too old to be measured now, right? Locked. I wonder what Dad keeps in here. I'm glad Dad kept Mom's perfume. It smells just like her. I hope I get to go practice with Dad again this summer. That does not look good. Ooh, 
The mystery of the secret key is solved. I know this drawing sucks, but it's cool that Dad put it here. Dad doesn't play Mom's records as much as before. I love listening to mom's old records. If I smoke in the fortress, I'm breaking the superhero code. Oh, I could use this to make some cool armor. Oh, I could use this to make some cool armor. They're naked? Whoa. Yes, this will totally protect me from Mantroid. One more piece and I'm almost done. Dad loves his cancer sticks. Gross. Wonder what they taste like. Careful of booby traps. Dad never told me he had a new friend. Wow, Dad had fans when he was playing in high school. That's scary. So we moved because dad couldn't pay for the house? That sucks. Dad got fired? That's when he started working for the railroad. I used to always talk about this basketball. Oh my God. Dad actually got me the new play box. No way. Mom and Dad would always let me sleep with them whenever I got scared. Oh man, 
She loved this song. I haven't listened to it since... for a long time. Long time. I've never seen Dad get that mad. It really scares me. I can feel the energy flow through me. I have the power. <sighs> My suit is almost ready. After I get some paint. I could take over the town with this army. Or the world. Are you kidding me, ref? Drop this guy and not me. This is Chris to the Flying Fortress. Come in, come in. Roger, I'm here. I hope so, Sky Pirate. What do you see up there? Have you spotted Snowmancer? Not yet. It's hard because of the storm. This is perfect cover for a Snowmancer sneak attack. I sharp. Keep me posted. Yes, sir. Roger that. <laughs> Thanks, Sky Pirate. Over and out. I know you're out there, Snowmancer. I miss playing ball with my friends before we moved. superhero should wear those, but they're so comfy. Dad. Hey, buddy, can you bring me a beer? You already drank a lot of beer. Thanks, bartender. Now get me the goddamn beer, okay? Okay, okay. That's right, it's okay. That's a nice cold one. Cheers. Man, that was fast, Dad. Well, excuse me. Okay, I'll slow down, Chris. This empty can is evil. Would Captain Spirit take care of it? Really? Yeah. Step aside, Mr. Erickson. Captain Spirit is here to recycle. Hey, <laughs> you better hurry. This can's gonna destroy the town. Man, that was too close. Thanks, Captain Spirit. I'm always here to lead my team to victory. Dad never smiles like that anymore. If 
I could go back in time, I'd go see him play. He looks so different in his basketball outfit. Dad was so popular. I wonder why Dad never hangs out with Nick anymore. I wish I could have gone on a hike with Mom. This has to be Mom's. She liked art. Let's check this out. Ooh, that looks scary. I should read that. I wish I could. This has to be Mom's. She liked art. Okay, you guys can't hide from me. Come on, come on, I got money on this. Dad, I found your car keys. That's where they went. I swear I had them on me, but they must have fell out of my pocket last night. Just put them in the bowl. Cool? Yeah. Good job, buddy. I'm sure I can beat my high score on Mustard Party, too. <laughs> that was not a foul. That's how it's done, yes! Yes, I can hack any system. Let's start.
I would love to see Hot Dog Man team up with Captain Spirit. Monster, the city needs hot water. Well, that wasn't too hard. I've tamed the water beast. Dad doesn't want to set up Christmas decorations yet. Makes him think I'm off. See what you're doing. Stop it. I don't do anything. Nothing can escape the deadly aim of the beer hunter.
nice miss, loser. Seek the magic key to unlock the portal to another dimension. Dude, the freaking key should be inside the house. I can't go anywhere without the keys. Extra bonus points unlocked. Dude, the freaking key should be inside the house. I can't go to Mantroid. I can't. I, I can't go to Mantroid's planet without finishing my costume.
I can't fight Snowmancer looking like this. No fair. Oh, Snowmancer. This is sad. You used to be a good enemy. Look at you now. How are you supposed to train me to fight Mandroid like that? What can we do? Dad won't fix the swing because it's too dangerous to fix. Behold, the flying fortress. The fortress looks safe since we last talked. I can't let Dad find my secret stash. Ever. <laughs> Open sesame. I loved watching Mom draw her comics. <sighs> Maybe I can use this to read the map. Now I can use this to reveal the full map to my next adventure. These are my favorite baseball players, even if I don't understand the stats. Harry did say mean things about Dad, but I can't let him see this. That's Noctarius' son. He looks like his dad. Dad keeps telling me this is a girl's doll. So what? She's the ice queen. Well, 
Maybe I could take one little puff. Slow, like Dad.
Mom was so pretty. I miss Mom's smile. Playtime all the time. Hey, spider baby, I think you caught your lunch in your web. And there's a snail moving so fast, he's in one place. <laughs> Made that noise. <sighs> Mom and Dad always talked about how they met at school.
It was weird having my mom as my kindergarten teacher, but fun. My first picture it looks so tiny and weird. Maybe I'm an alien baby. This is where mom went to school before we came here. Mom didn't go to art school because of me, but she was already an amazing artist. Oh wow, I remember when mom drew that and dad couldn't stop laughing. I don't get this one. I'm too young. Now I can color Captain Spirit just like my drawing. Yes, it's actually Captain Spirit to the rescue. And it's time to visit Mantroid's home planet for a change. If Dad used a padlock, he wants to keep me out. Dad never threw away Mom's hiking boots. Good. What kind of code would he use? Yes! <sighs> Grandma and Grandpa were so nice. I wish we saw them more. I know Dad spent a lot of money on the funeral. A lot. Thanks for storing my explosives, Chief. Now I'm ready to rock. Sorry, Dad.
Now you are ready to battle with Captain Spirit. almost cruised the whole city until Captain Spirit melted him. For now. Jerks. Like people don't drink in bars around here. Come, man, Troid. Come on, let's get going. This is Captain Spirit. Do you copy? Are you there, Sky Pirate? Captain Spirit, I read you loud and clear. Are you sure you want to go on this dangerous mission? Don't worry about me. Man, Troid is the one in danger. Gotta do a quick system check first. Instrument panel, check. Force field, check. Proton missiles, check. Escape pod, check. Windshield wipers, check. Everything looks good. Start the launch. We're going faster than light speed. What's that ahead? Oh no, meter shower. Turn on the force field. Too late. Emergency! SOS! Crash landing! Ah! I wonder how many ships Mantroid has crashed on this planet. Never mind. I landed safe. Time to explore! The planet is so dark, and the sky is so red, like blood. No wonder man Troyd lives here. But how could anyone live here? It's kind of sad and lonely. What's that sound? Something is coming. Or somebody. Man, Troy, show yourself, you coward! Oh! 
No, I can't let you live. <laughs> You will pay for what you did, Man Troid. I swear. I hate seeing him like this. Dad, you, you sleeping? Hey, wake up. Dad, come on. Huh? What? Who's there? Who's that? Dad, it, it's just me, Chris. Whoa, whoa, hold on, buddy, okay? Jesus. Fuck! Dad, are you okay? Do I look okay? No. I tripped. Can't even watch one goddamn game. <sighs> Fuck! Uh, that's just great. Oh, I think I sprained my foot. Shit. Chris, why did you wake me up? You, you told me to wake you up. I thought, I thought you said the pine tree. <sighs> pine tree? I can't even walk in my own house, man. You should be careful when you're, you know, when you wake up. Don't be a smart ass, Chris. I'm not in the mood right now. Yeah, Dad. Okay. Jesus Christ, who is that? Go answer. If it's some salesperson or some church group, you just close the door on them. It's nobody's business. This is our castle, and it's our family. Right? Right. Oh my, look at you. What kind of costume is that? I'm Captain Spirit. Of course you are. We need all the superheroes we can get. And how are you doing, Chris? Good, Mrs. Reynolds. Just, just. Just? Just. Hanging out playing video games. You boys and your video games. You should play games outside like we used to. Like your dad used to. Oh, I know, I know. I'm old. But I did see you clearing that snow off the front porch. So good of you. Actually, I, I was going for a nice walk, but it sounded like the 4th of July over here. Is everything okay? Totally! Me and my dad were just decorating the tree, and I tripped over the lights, and the tree almost crashed on me. But dad caught it, and he fell, so... so... Gee, that's some story. Is everybody all right? Um, yeah. Must have been quite a scare. I hope you have something else planned for today.
I wanted to fix up the treehouse. Maybe Steven could come by and help? Well, that sounds like a fun job for a father and son, right? Yeah, but, you know, my dad isn't good at building stuff like Steven. Oh, Lordy, don't I know it. And Steven loves any excuse to break out the toolkit to help you. He's way better with hammers than Dad. Yes, he certainly is. Steven would probably build you a tree city if you asked. So don't you dare. You're a good son, Chris. Listen, Chris, I'm only steps away from your house. If you ever feel scared, you can come visit us anytime, day or night. Understand? We're here for you. Okay. Sure. Thanks. Thanks, Claire. I promise I'll see you later. So what did that nosy bitch want? N nothing. Oh, nothing, huh? I was listening. I heard it all. You could have gotten rid of her. I tried. Man, I bet you wanted to tell her what a shitty dad you have. Huh? No, she just wanted to say hi. I didn't say anything, Dad. I swear. Dad, please believe me. Jesus, stop that whining. You're not a baby anymore. Oh, boo-hoo, Daddy. Believe me. Grow up. But I... You're just... Just like your mom. Every time I look at you, I tell me you talk. Stop it. I, just, just, I see your face. Why? And if it wasn't for you, she would have never taken the car that day. Never. Oh, hey, Chris, look, hey, I didn't mean that, buddy. Yes! Yes, you did! No, listen, Chris! <laughs> <laughs>